What is going on, my fellow gamers? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. You may have saw my live stream. I believe it was, what, Thursday? Two days ago? And we unlocked the Porsche 911 GT3 RS. We got the 20 points. We actually got 21 points. And I've already tuned it. You saw in the live stream. So if you want to know how I tuned it, Go back to that live stream, go to like an hour and I think like 10 minutes or something. And anyway, um, what I'll do is I'll do a recap of how I did it in case you weren't around for the live stream. Uh, first of all, I made the color red because why not? Uh, first thing I did was make it all redrive. drive. I didn't do a engine swap. I didn't give it any uh, specialized turbos. Uh, for tires, we already have the best tire compound. Uh, for tire width, I put it to max at 285. Put the rear max at 345. Front track width, I raised it to level 1. Uh, this ain't changed. This ain't changed. Uh, let's see. Drive train, I gave it a 7 speed. I did a drive line. I did a differential. Let's see what else I do. We already got brakes in there. We already got the uh, springs and dampers in there. We already got all that stuff, the intro bars, all that gibber jazz. So that's already taken care of. I do believe it has its own little, uh, I guess, sport type um, uh, roll cage, but it's clearly not visible. But, you know, it's the option isn't available for it, which is fine. Uh, weight reduction, I did put that in there. And then for engine upgrades, I believe I did all but this and this. Let me just double check. Intake, yes. Exhaust, yes. Camshaft, I did not do. Okay, so scratch that last part. <clears throat> Excuse me. Brace valves. And then I didn't do a flywheel because that. So then that's how I did the horsepower tune. 518 stock, I raised it to 625. Four, I believe. Uh, custom tuning, tire pressure, your gearing, which is pretty much stock. This I did. This I did. Springs I put to that. Mostly, I would have left stock, but you know, because of uh, this was actually all the way up to the high part. I'm like, first of all, this ain't no rally vehicle, my guy. <laughs> but like, you know, anyway. Um, this I know I changed. This I changed. This I put to seven. This kind of stayed straight for the most part. This stays stock for the most part. And then all these I put to 50. This was at 60, but I would put it for 50%, but I'm like, nah. I figured I'd just put it right in the middle between the two, so 55 would be like the proper balance or whatever. Uh, so I just have to go with that, and I figured, you know what, screw it. I'll just leave it go with that because... You know, it gives it that uh, front end balance and all wheel drive balance and stuff like that for the track, making it easy for myself and the car as well. So that's pretty much about it. Um, that's a bit of a video I want to do for this guy in particular. I did pretty much everything else. There is one thing I want to do, and that's basically give it a. I want to put it for a speed run challenge if I can. So, what I'll do is I'll just go to point A to point B, see how fast I can do it. So, as you can tell, I'm not using my wheel for this video. I'm using my Xbox controller, 2022, Velocity Green. It's plugged in with my PC via USB. So, that's kind of how I'm doing it. Anyway, let's go from here to, say, uh, let's go to somewhere up north. Let's actually go from there to the stadium. Like, right at the outskirts. Like, right, like, right here. All right, are we ready? Three. Bruh. Okay, are we ready? Three, two, one, go. You know, I might actually have to edit the uh, point in the video where I just 
use like a uh, thing for my phone and just make sure I can do it that way because you know what I'll do is I'll use like a uh, stopwatch thing in the clock app on my phone and then do it that way. It's the only way I can actually do it until I get the timer thing um, onto my screen lap. So that's the only way I can do it. That's actually the only way I can do it for now. It's like a temporary. So that's the only way I can do it. It's a temporary. All right, we good so far. Come on, let's, let's keep it going. Oh, okay, well, okay, ow. Duh. I was gonna knock the second off, almost. Out of my way, Bozo. Come on, I ain't got time for this. There you go, nice. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Go, 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 go. Yeah, no skill point, I see that. Alright, and make the turn here. Great. Make a turn. So far, excellent. So far, excellent. We good. We good. Pass these guys up ahead. Looks like I can definitely get away with that. That's fine. All right, we should be at the home stretch. Go right between them, perfect. How's that? That's fine. I believe we're closing in on it. I believe we're closing in on it. It should be. It should be. You know what? Not bad. Not bad at all. That was impressive. That was actually impressive. Okay. I am actually high. Anyway. <sighs> anyway, I am actually satisfied with that result. Okay. You know what? See if you guys can beat this time. Seriously. Same tune. If you have the car, which would be majorly beneficial get the car if you haven't put the tune you saw in this video it's the exact same one from last game custom tuning use the control if you have to which would be better because you can get better angling wheel not recommended but seriously try it beat that time you just saw I will see you guys in the next video or short or whatever they may post I'll tell you you guys stay safe you guys stay awesome. Y'all take it easy. Bye-bye. <laughs>